Jim Norlin hasn't farmed since 1973. But this year, he has a different reason for climbing into the driver's seat. We're going to have a classic tractor show, the first ever at Home Economy this year. Norland says since the year 2000, he's fixed up close to 15 antique tractors from all around the region. Between him and his two sons, they own about 60 tractors. All of them are Oliver's. Back in 1939, Oliver had six-cylinder engines, and a lot of tractors back in that time didn't have them, and a lot of manufacturers didn't put six-cylinders in until the late mid-50s and early 60s. Norland says he's been driving Oliver tractors since he was seven years old, but that hasn't made him biased. I still have 20 years under my belt working for John Deere, too, so uh, I know those fairly well, and, and uh, they're a good tractor also. But Oliver holds a special place in his family's history, especially one he still keeps in his garage. It's actually my dad's tractor. He bought it new back in 1968, and. Uh, when he had his auction sale, a friend of his bought it, and then when he passed away, I was able to buy it back from the estate, and it's, it's a very close tractor to my heart because I drove it a lot when I was a kid. Norland says he will bring three tractors to the show. That way, everyone can see the diverse and rolling wheels of history. In Deluxe, Bonnie Campo, KX News.